Pastor Dale. Yeah? I'm mad at my mom. You are? What's the matter? Well, she wants me to get rid of some of my toys. Okay, like, I mean, what toys? Well, you know, the ones that I had when I was a baby. Okay, well, do you still play with them? Well, no. Well, then what's the big deal? Because they're mine. Mine, 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 mine. You have a hard time giving things up? Uh, yeah, just a little. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can tell. Well, you know, that kind of reminds me of Abraham in today's story. Really? Did he have to give up some toys? Uh, no, God wanted him to give up his son. His what? Yeah, you know, he had waited for Isaac to be born and, you know, till he was a hundred and, and, and he was born and, and, um, and then after a little while, God wanted him to, uh, to give up his son. But, whoa. Then what happened? Well, Abraham trusted that God would provide for him. And... And in fact, he trusted he would provide for both of them somehow. And he didn't know how, but he just trusted that God knew what he was talking about and that it would be okay. So did God provide for him? Yeah. Yeah. He took uh, Isaac up on the mountain and uh, he was about to lose him. And then a ram showed up and he was able, the ram took Isaac's place so that he was able to keep Isaac. Wow, God really provides for us. Yeah, he does. Yeah, but that's different. How's it different? Well, I mean, God doesn't know what it's like. What do you mean? Well, God's never had to give up anything important to him. He hasn't? No, he's God. He has everything. He can have anything he wants. If he wants a bowl of soup, boom, there's a bowl of soup. If he wants dandelion pie, boom, there's dandelion pie. Hungry? Yeah, a little bit. Well, you know what? God does know what it's like to to lose something, give up something really important to him. Oh, yeah, like what? His son. What? His son, Jesus. He gave up Jesus to die on the cross for us. Right? That was, that was a huge loss because he loves his son. And he gave him up for us so that we could live forever because he loves us that much. Yeah, God didn't want to lose us. He was not willing to lose us. He would do anything it took, even giving up Jesus. Wow, he really does love us. Yeah, yeah, he provided Jesus for us, just like he provided that ram to save Isaac. Wow, God really does provide. Yeah, yeah, he really does. Hey, let's thank him for that. Good idea. Will you pray with us? Dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. For taking our place. For taking our place. So that we could be. So we can be. Forever with you. Forever with you. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Wow. So question for families. What are some things that are valuable to you? And how do you take care of it? What do you do to take care of those valuables? And since you're so valuable to God, how does he take care of you? And you guys can talk about that. Those are good questions. Yeah, I thought so. And you know what else is valuable? What's that? Everyone! Yeah, that's true. So you can share this with a friend so that they can know how valuable they are, too. That's a good idea. Happy Easter, Jeff. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my turn this time. Okay, go ahead. He is risen! He is risen indeed. Hallelujah. Bye-bye, everybody.